No solution in sight. The ransomware attack on the city of Oakland moves now into its second week with many workers and residents wondering when it's going to get fixed. KTVU's Tom Vakar live in the newsroom tonight. And Tom, you're at police headquarters today when it comes to filing reports, getting records. Were people having a tough time? Tough and long, to say the least. Oakland's reputation is getting smeared again by an uninvited ransomware hacking of its computer systems, this time even at police headquarters. At Oakland Police Headquarters, there was bad news even before visitors walked in. Ransomware hacked computers have ground Oakland City government to a near halt. People lined up in the police headquarters lobby to file reports, working with clerks severely handicapped by non-functioning computers essential to their work. Anything that got done was done by hand. Any payments made were made in cash, no credit cards or checks. None of those in line were in the mood to talk to us. But by Zoom, Shanata Norwood told KTVU it took her two visits over two days and finally two hours to file a simple stolen car report. Now, I do understand that it's a non-emergency report. However, I just felt that there was absolutely no urgency from the dispatcher on the non-emergency number down to the officer at the station. I understand the frustration, yeah. you know, many of, um, you know, when we conduct business at mm -hmm. City Hall, that some of the resources aren't there, right. but, um, you know, I, we want to say bear with us. In a statement issued on Tuesday and authorized by the new mayor, Sheng Tao, the Oakland Police Department wisely advised citizens for non-emergency crimes, we encourage residents to file an online police report. In the meantime, the public should expect delays. My team is working around the clock to make sure that, you know, we are moving the city forward. Now, an Oakland City employee, uh, employee told KTVU that workers who want to know who about turning in their time cards on Wednesday, well, they've been told that the payroll system is affected by this hack and they don't know how to proceed. If paychecks are delayed, expect an even louder outcry coming from City Hall. Tom Baker, KTVU, Fox 2. Now loud indeed. All right, Tom, thank yeah. you.